It's a pretty nerve-wracking ride down the driveway. Oh, look, he's wiggling his ass off. It's like vibrations stimulate them to wiggle. And they wiggle their skin off. Or their, they shed their outer layer that way. Oh, I'm trying not to bump him too much. Hang on, guys. We'll be on a real road soon. Hi, we're Paige, Casey, and Henry Wilder, an adventurous trio from the Ozarks of Northwest Arkansas. Join us as we explore in our motorhome and in our own backyard as we seek out authentic travel experiences and ways of living for our small family of three. It's Rip City over there. <laughs> this is the best place to. Oh, keep cutting me off. You broke couch. Okay. It is 3:30. It took us all day yeah. to pack. It's a big trip. Yeah. It feels good to be on the road, but... Good if they're done charging. Somebody might need to use use them now. The walkie talkies? Yeah. Yeah. They're charged, huh? We have made it to our first stop. And somebody does need to need it need it right now and it's me. Mm, no, you don't need those. What's the game plan, Mom? Where are we? What are we doing? I'm starving. Mom's hungry. I'm hungry. So I'm getting dinner started. You probably need to hook us up. I'm going to hook us up look to some power this, and water. Look at this. Caterpillar update. Oh yeah, they made it. They're selling their cups. Through the worst f***ing roads in Arkansas. They're all still attached. They survived. Something fell off the front of the RV, it sounded like at one point. I know, something. I'm going to oh, look yeah, under there and see. You need to check the roof too. <laughs> I checked the roof. I dragged a branch. Uh, but yeah, we need to move those to their tent probably tonight. Okay, water and power so we can keep the fridge cool without and then, wasting like, gas. We have pets, like the RV cannot get hot. It's like we're leaving like a cat in here, a dog. Okay. I think. We're definitely leaving a cat or pillar. Yeah. <laughs> There it is. Give me a five. The caterpillars are getting moved to their new home. You want to come watch? Clear away any like leaves swebbing. That. Yeah, before we pull it because it will pull them down. We did it. Oh, that's it. That bottom one's gonna it's all right. <gasps> He's, He's wiggling. Out. All right, I'm gonna try him and... this way. No, that's gonna hit that guy. It's the best you can do, Mum, but go figure it out. They wow. all freaked out. That freaked me out. It's like dead asleep.
I think I'm gonna try to find a place for this in the bathroom since that's the least trafficked area and they're not supposed to sit in direct sun. In the in the wild, they would get wind balloon and stuff. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. This drive is like a storm. This is where I think they're gonna be. Live for now. Yeah. Cool. Um, we'll figure out drive. Things. Enjoy your pupating. Okay, and everyone can, you know, maybe you'll be pooping and you'll be like, "Wow, a butterfly is working." A butterfly well, came out of come, my ass. Oh wait, like, no. Everyone come look, here. and then I was like, "Poop." I'm be yelling. Everyone come to the bathroom and look. The pupa. I mean, major RV life update. The food's over here now. <laughs> We're trying and it all the it. rando stuff's over there. This is baking pantry baking stuff. Baking pantry. This is coffee, and then that's like Henry's cooking stuff. And then these are all the dishes, dishes. and towels and things. Cool. I thought I heard a lot food. more rattling behind me this time than usual, and I thought something was wrong with the rig, but all the dishes were over here now. Dishes? They were packed really well. Yeah, no, I just meant more than usual. Okay, well. Part of driving the old shitty RV is you listen to all the sounds, and it's not that you hear sounds and it disturbs you. You just go, "Oh, that's a new sound. Wonder what that is." Uh huh. We're having pot stickers. They're over here. Yummy, yummy, yummy. Henry's playing Legos. How's it going, Lego butt? He's desperate for play. Been in a car seat too long. Morning. Where Let's are you going? Good go, guys. Look, the big lake's over there. The big lake. There's water over there. Good morning, Mom. How's it going? <laughs> We're gonna go play mini golf. Right now? In a little while. Does it sound good? Too sleepy to play mini golf. Go to bed. Okay, Henry, you want to tell me what we're doing this morning? Putting laundry. <laughs> washing laundry. We are washing laundry. Washed it with the soap and now we're rinsing it with the water. Squeeze any extra water out. Wow, good hit. That's nice.
You did it! Will you catch him? <laughs> that wasn't so bad. I've been down some of these that go really fast. Was that fun? Oh, he's doing it! Wow! Yeah, that's a good spot. There you go. Look, this is a butt spot too. You can see right here. This butt's kind of small. Yeah. I can get on here. Yeah, just hold on like that. <laughs> right, Dad, be ready to catch Uncle Cody too if yeah. he falls. <laughs> yeah, a little bit. Caterpillar Henry. Yeah, I'm gonna flip over into orbit. <laughs> Check it out, I just reorganized Henry's closet stuff and I'm pretty stoked on how this is working out. I moved all of his clothes into these two bottom drawers because he can access those really easily. And then, this is like all my homeschool stuff, so that's that. And then I just set up these boxes like this with his ball, shoes, his backpack with all his stuff in it some games and stuff and when we go to drive I can just flip them up right so that things don't slide forward and then like this is just like my crap because he can't reach up here obviously so it's like bike bags and stuff I'm just trying to make sure like the lowest level is the things I really want him to be able to access on his own and he can actually when these are closed he can climb up in here so I was trying to make sure there was room for him to stand there <laughs> and then he can like get to his stuff so I'm pretty excited about this. It's just been, this has been kind of a constant struggle, like figuring out how to use this closet for him. I think we need to like build in some shelves or drawers or something. So anyway, that's exciting. I'm glad to have that. I was just putting away some of our high clean laundry, because we did laundry. How cool is that? And I think we're getting ready to go on just like a little bike ride. There's a short trail. Um, that we hiked last time we were here, but we might ride it and it's hot so everything's melting <laughs> Jeez, <laughs> close pass Monster truck. Oh, yeah, you're going straight back to your truck. So his feet were already like walking when they touched the ground <laughs> Whoa But you're not, because Dan's always, Dan always rides in the, in the, in the passengers, you know, the, the front passenger seat of an Uber. So that's how you know you're not in an Uber, because Dada's driving? Yeah. What if Dada we're, were an Uber driver? Now that's the one situation where you could get in an Uber and Dada'd be driving. <laughs> we're going to the family picnic. You feel good? Is it tightened up? Good. Which is the whole reason that we, like, launch this trip huh that's why we're going to the gulf now the gulf trip was a separate trip and then we had to come down for this and it's like hey we're already four hours in the right direction let's keep going so yeah today's family picnic and then tomorrow we head further south all right you ready head up i'm putting on your headset in. oh wow Paige's video editing by the campfire video uh, the snake. The snake video. Got our bike battery charging station. Henry's just had bedtime. I've got the iPad out to do some trip planning. Ooh, yeah. We're considering changing our route.
doing more in a single day, trying to beat some of the, there's a bunch of rain. What's the rain situation? Can you tell them? Do you know? Uh, so, <laughs> I do know. It's gonna rain for like four days all no, up and down the no, Gulf. No, no, no. Point is we that are concerned with the there's like four days of drive. rain and we've gotta figure out ways to drive through it and get to where we're going so that we can be there when the rain's gone. So we might just like, we have a window tomorrow with no rain. We might just drive as far as we can get through it. Yes, I think that's a good idea. We just need to see where the end of that is so we can let a harvest host know we're coming. Yep, bye. Is today the third day of our trip? I think so. I think it's day three. We're packing up to head from Hot Springs Village to our next destination. We're trying to beat the rain. Headed to a harvest host. We think. We think. Haven't heard back from them. Everyone showered. Henry. Doggy. Doggy. Did you lose your doggy? Henry's playing magnet tiles while we pack up. Ooh, those. Check this out, YouTube. We got this. I don't know. I think it's like a knockoff thing on Amazon. Team Obsidian. Uh, extra large travel case for the bikes that fits great over henry's bike seat and the handlebars and inside the tire awesome to keep our stuff protected when we're driving through the rain later today it's a drive day we're going to nacogdoches is that how you say it it's like spelled naco nacogdoches they're gonna say it not how it's spelled we'll, find, we'll find out when you we get there split it texas out nacogdoches <laughs> you won't miss this neighbor. Nope. Usually miss many of them. We're all unhooked and everything, yeah? We don't appear to be dragging anything when I check the <laughs> rear views. Texas! Lunch stop. Henry, are you hungry for lunch? And then Tien check this out. Tina Sombre? Yeah. Oh yeah. Did you see where we are? No. Can you see out the window? What's that? What is that? A pot. <gasps> That's A right. Pot. What is that? Peanut butter and jelly? No. I have a leftover half a sandwich, some pepperoni, hummus, some veggies. It's a it's a picnic. Dad's still making his sandwich. I had leftovers, so I get to eat first. I'm so hungry. And look, that's next. Henry is so ready to play. Whoa! Good job. Whoa! Stretch your legs, do some yoga poses. I'm taking a pit stop. Oh my f god, look at how gray my beard is. So it's gonna rain in about 15, 20 minutes. Rain's coming soon. Okay, we'll figure it out. We are stopped in Carthage, Texas. Is that what we said, Henry? Shout out. Someone probably lives here. So, shout out to Carthage. Looking sharp. Baptist Church is a great parking spot. Um, we're about 43 miles from our anticipated final destination, but our harvest host finally got back to us and said, no vacancy. Oh no! 
Why are you filming us? You're talking. Oh, dramatic. Dramatic. Oh, no. Thank you. So we're either gonna keep going or find a state park. I don't know. We've beat the rain so far, but there's still rain in the forecast. Thousand feet. Slide left onto West Sabine Street. We are going to stay at a KOA tonight. We don't know how much it costs, but Casey called. They have lots of spots, so we're just gonna show up and pay what they tell us to. And we'll have a place to be. The rain chance keeps changing, like going away. So I think we'll be able to make there without make it there without stopping. We don't want to drive in the rain. You should see this windshield wiper. Can you see? Kind of flopping up there. On his side, it's like not attached. Uh, very well. It just looks. We need new wipers. So yeah, we're going to a KOA. I don't think I've stayed at a KOA maybe like one time in my life. I've never stayed in an RV. I think they have like free pancakes in the morning. What? I think. That's I don't worth know. whatever they charge us tonight. I don't know if that's still a thing, but they always have like lots of amenities, so it'll be kind of fun to see what they have. They did the pictures showed like there was a little store. A little store. Hey, I've got a running list going already. We're on only like day four, we all have three. Pens at nine degree yeah, water. <laughs> we need really weird things, but batteries. They'll definitely have batteries, I'm sure. Okay. Yeah, For his headlamp. Yeah. Um, and then the other thing is that what so our our real destination here is Port Aransas. They're under like flood warnings. It's rain. It's gonna rain every day for like a week there. Um, so we're not really sure what we're gonna do about going there. And maybe like I don't know. We'll just see. We might work around it and only stop there on the way back. Yeah, yeah that might be. Yeah, we may go to. Padre and then back to Port A and then back that that makes a lot of sense yeah anyway so it's all very up in the air I'm really relieved that we didn't have to book anything for this trip there's like a lot of flexibility there and, were about, we had about 40 state parks as options yeah lots of options and then when we were kind of checking to make sure like things weren't getting booked up there was always lots of spaces so it's kind of fun we never travel like this we're super planners I feel like this could have made me really anxious, yeah. but I'm actually really enjoying the flexibility, especially with the weather. It's really raining now, but the road just got smooth, and we are... Yeah, we've been driving on a washboard for a couple of hours, and we are almost to our destination, maybe half an hour, 45 minutes. 35 minutes. So, I think that I'm going to stop at an auto parts store. Yeah, get one. That'd be good. Yeah, he's got, um, his is not working very well. Mine, mine gets it clear. <laughs> yeah, don't knock it off. I know, I'm gonna back it off. Yeah, don't go too crazy. At least it's doing what it's doing. Yeah, it's somewhere. Oh, pump. Big tank. <laughs> Takes a long time to spend all your money when it goes that slow. <laughs> bye bye, money. We made it to the KOA. Casey's gonna take you inside and show you whatever. Oh, well. I mean, look, I just pulled up in the parking lot like a car and parked here, which I think is funny. We're not that long. Here we go. Door's closed. Night registration. Night registration. Well, I found it. Come on in. It's full on this page. It's full on the book. Cool. At the book library over here. A little bar. Go find number 46. Why? They're eating outside. Why are they eating outside? Bro, because it's nice weather. 46? Guy, these guys brought a freaking pergola. No, those are here. Oh. Other exercise competitions. Oh, 
the chrysalids traveled in the sink did really well so safe travels chrysalids i'm excited for some butterflies it's been enough time that we should start to see them emerge as butterflies pretty soon so that's exciting Here's dinner. I put some Mexican cheese on it because we decided cheese is cheese. I added some vegetables to the sauce because we had vegetables. Ta-da! Guys, really good timing. It just started pouring. The rain finally came. And we got here just in time to cook dinner. Watch our favorite show. I went on a four minute walk. We watch our own YouTube videos. He does every day. And he doesn't week. get to see him when we edit them, so. It's late at night and Casey likes to rewatch them. This was a Christmas present <laughs> that we got five months later. Very belated. COVID. Due to COVID. Or we COVID think, Christmas. COVID Christmas in May. It was purchased at Christmas time, but the food will all be fine. Yeah. This is all well preserved. This is all made to survive nuclear winter. What's this? I don't know what that is. It feels like peanuts. It's like an MRE. Aren't these cute? Do we each get one we have to share? So do we get to just go all out and snack? First of all, yeah, this is the state of America. This is too many calories for movie night, folks. Can't have all this in one movie night. But I will be eating the red vines and the popcorn and the dogs. We'll so we have all of it. Do we need these little cup holder things for anything? I don't think so. I don't plan on roller skating around with these. You know, like in general though, like... In our life? No. Also no. Going with no. Sorry, I thought you were debating. I thought you were like no, still thinking about it. Was, does everybody break you, down their recycling and trash like this? We have to. Cat. Cat alert. Kitty cat. <gasps> meow 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 meow. It's meow. gonna live under the RV now. Don't put your tail in the drive check, shaft. Check the hood before we drive. I can't stop. <laughs> What's that thing? If you like this week's video, be sure to subscribe. Next week, we gotta make some road repairs as we fight the rain to work our way across Corpus Christi Bay by bridge and by boat and get a chance to camp directly on the beach in the RV. We also weather out some pretty crazy storms. There we are. There we are on the edge. I followed the instruction. We pushed down the top of that.